Greetings, adventurers! Welcome to Morrowind. Today, I believe that we will start by doing a little work with the Fighters Guild. We've been ignoring them for a little bit of time, and I think that it's time that we give them the attention that they, well, deserve is a strong word, require. Mm. Uh, if you are watching this and you are new to the series, uh, thank you for watching. Uh, please take a moment to subscribe and like this video uh, so that it may find its way into the algorithm and to other people who may enjoy its content. Uh, furthermore, if you wish to engage with me on social media, uh, you can find me on Twitter at Commander Calgon. Also on Facebook, Commander Calgon, no spaces. And soon I will be arriving on Twitch <coughs> at Commander underscore Calgon. Is somebody sick in here? Somebody coughed. Coughing is not allowed right now. Dear God, wear a mask. In any case. Let us continue our journey. I take it you want something. You... Well, what is it? I want to get... Physical, physical, I wanna get... Not really. Oh, that's right. We already took this quest. So we shall go forth. Welcome, friend. To Caldera. We don't need to walk to Caldera. We are blessed, truly blessed. This is an honor. I get so much love at the Mage's Guild. Why would I ever leave? May I help you? Yes, I would like to go to Caldera. Go ahead. Three blessings. She's gone too far. I'll see. Excellent. All is well. Go ahead. I'm listening. Let's just go confront the Telvani agents. located at the Caldera Ebony Mine. Hmm. Your name says Alaveg, but my brain says Target!
and she should have summoned that skeleton. I would have summoned that skeleton. Ah, shit. Oh, oh, I didn't know. Oh, I didn't know that's what that did. Future reference Disposing of corpse loots it completely. Which is not what we wanted. Although absolutely taking absolutely everything from these people would probably fetch some kind of some kind of decent price. However, we do not want everything that they have. But that would leave us over encumbered and unable to take anything of more value. Of course, they spread all of their gold amongst every crate that they possibly have. Shock Eater Row. Goodness, woman, why were you not wearing this? The name's Shock Eater, and you don't, you don't even... Varden Fellians. Truly perplex me. Probably worth it. Yeah, why don't we uh, use one of these? Still trapped. Okay. Well, it's health up. Let's see what we got. Ow. Got here. Ooh, 36 Lessons of Vivek. Seems pretty cool. Exclusive Restore Endurance, which, you know, I'm not sure if I really need to, but... Ah, oh, shit. What did, I do? what did I just do? What did I just do? Wow, I'm right at I'm right at the level. Uh, fails. Fails.
Oh, I see you're waiting for me, slaughterfish. Have at you, slaughterfish. Someone dumped a skirt down here. How delightfully droll! Holy, wow. Stack of stuff. Yeah, maybe, maybe I'll be back for it. It's all nice, nicely and neatly piled for the next adventure to take. I unfortunately can't take this man's exquisite shield. Value of 230. Weight of 12. Something that I can... Ooh. Ooh. All right, let us move on. We have accomplished our task. We have dispatched the Telvani agents. Our success and our victories know no bounds. We shall surely overcome all obstacles that lay before us. The people will know the name Draven Gur, and they will stand in awe and fear. Do you need something? No. I see you. Hello. Hail and welcome. Do you have any milk? I need something. Fantastic. How wonderful. Good to see you too, Rainus. Glad to see that we're in such good spirits today. Can you ask your question quickly? I must be going. Idris, I got some got some good news. Yes, I've got all four. Good. That'll make some people at Caldera Mining Company very happy. And here are four hundred septums. The Caldera Mining Company pays well, and when you're ready for more orders, let me know. Well, as it would happen, I'm ready for more orders. I need somebody to return a code book that belongs to our client. The code book our client wants is in the hands of a of Sotilde at Southwall and Balmora. Find that code book and bring it to me. Seen any elves? <laughs> I have no reaction to that. Oh, my ear, let's hear it. In the elves, I am an elves, Edis. Beldor. Crude bastard, you.
I couldn't. We are blessed, truly blessed. This is an honor. Is there somebody that I can talk to to perhaps take these off my hands that will pay me a fair price? Under sun and sky, Outlander. Under sun and sky, indeed. I'm listening, please. Go ahead. Hmm. I'm sure Revere will buy it at a severely discounted price. Wait. Ah, oh, she's a pawnbroker, isn't she? Is she an Altmer or Dunmer? I cannot remember. She's a Dunmer. Wait, what's our reputation at? Ugh. Eh, it all goes towards it. Persuasion? Damn it. Fine. Take my 200 gold. Eh. Is there something I can do for you? Broke even. Broke even. Actually, what Is else can I Is there something you need? Little Morwen lore. Let me tell you about the blight. You, I already know about the blight. You're not telling me anything that I don't already know. Unfortunately. Uh, I have got a lot of stuff. Ooh, let us read. Let us read by the light of Balmora's many ca candle lanterns. The 36 Lessons of Vivek. Sermon 14. Vivek lay with Molag Bol for 80 days and ate through Headless. In that time, the prince placed the warrior poet's feet back and filled them with the blood of Daedra. In this way, Vivek's giant form remained forever harmless to good earth. The pomegranate banquet brought many spirits back from the dead so that the sons and daughters of the Union had much to eat besides fruit. The Duke of Scamps came while the banquet was still underway, and Molag Ball looked on the seven pennants with anger. The King of Rape had become, un had become necessary and therefore troubled for the rest of time. His legions and the Ka'atas fell into open war, but the children of Molag Ball and Vivak were too elaborate in power and form. The Duke of Scamps therefore became a lesser thing, as did all his own children. Molag Ball said to them, You are the sons of liars, dogs, and wolf-headed women. They have been useless to summon ever since. The Holy One returned at last, Vech, golden with wisdom. His head found its body had been tenderly used. He mentioned this to Molag Ball, who told him that he should thank the barons of Move like this. For I have yet to learn how to refine my rapture. My love is accidentally shaped like a spear. So Vivac, who had a grain of Aeum's mercy, set about to teach Molag Balls in the ways of belly magic. They took their spears out and compared them. Vivac bit new- Jesus Christ. <laughs> it's like, I can't- <laughs> They took their spears out and compared them. Vivac bit new words onto the King of Rapes so that it might give more than ruin to the uninitiated. This has since become a forbidden ritual, though people still practice it in secret. Here is why. The Velothi and demons and monsters that were watching all took out their own spears. There was much biting and the earth became wet. And this was the last lap of Mullock Ball. Watch as the earth shall crack heavy with so much power that should have ne have been forever unalike. Then, that stretch of badlands that had been the site of the marriage fragmented and through fire. And a race that is no more, but that was terrible at the time to behold came forth. Born of the biters, that is all they did. 
and they ran amok am across the lands of Veloth and even to the shores of Red Mountain. But Vivac made his spear a more terrible thing. From a secret, he had bitten off from the King of Rape. And so he sent Mullagbal tumbling into the crack of the biters, and swore forever that he would not deem the king beautiful ever again. Vivek wept as he slew all those around him with his terrible new spear. He named it Muratra, which is Milk Talker, and even the Chimeri mystics knew his fury. Anyone struck by Vivek at this time turned barren and withered in bone shapes. The path of bones became a sentence for the stars to read, and the heavens have known no have never known children since. Vivac hunted down the biters one by one and all their progeny, and he killed them all by the means of the nine apertures, and the wise still hide from their from Muratra. The ending of the words is Alm Sipi. How very poetic. Curious they were talking about their spears an awful lot. Hmm. Was it code for something else, I wonder? Make it quick, Outlander. She gives me $85 for that. Here. Aladdis Demnavani has studied Dwemer ruins all over Vaudenfell. I hear he's always looking for books on Dwemer. Now we go to the Clothia, sell our, uh, our simple wares. Oh, well, or, or her, what's that? Five dollars, cheapskate. Wait, did I already sell that? I guess I already sold that. Did I? Oh yeah, I already sold that to. Alrighty, uh, let's see what we can sell. Get rid of the. We can probably get all this. I don't want to get rid of the fire shield, lightning shield, frosting shield, restored personality. Yeah, I don't want to. Those are restored strength. Yeah. We can get rid of those. Keep the flint. Low weight. I don't really I haven't really had a need for the fatigue. Not yet, anyways. We may need it. We may need it at some point. But I would like to have some of this weight back. So I've got a lot of this stuff. Okay, well that's like a that's like one a Pete. Wow, okay. 
Uh, I didn't know. Man, these things really. Potions really I take up a lot of. My duty. Potions really take up a lot of. Uh, Masera. A lot. Let us go and get um, the code book. There's a code book that is required. I do not believe I have any more scrolls left that would aid me in this adventure. Welcome, friend. We extend you our warm regard. Thank you, Rainus. It's always a pleasure to be back at the Mage's Guild. I'm so glad that there is some place on Earth that uh, known that. You. Good friend, this is an honor. Take that Telvani bug mask. All right, to the South Wall Corner Club. To engage in negotiations. Ah, Satilde. Okay, friend, you know about the code book. I don't want any trouble with you, so just take it. Just don't tell anyone I gave it to you. Fantastic! I'm glad we could work this out. You slap on a little cologne, and the ladies love you. And so they give you whatever you want. The tale is old as time. Thank you, sir. I appreciate that. What's my reputation? One. Ah. Oh. But I lose. You know what? It doesn't. It, it matches not. Wrong. Right. Welcome, friend. I take it you want something. Well, what is it? I have the code book. Here's your 57, 50 septums, Gravenger. The guild needs more like you, obedient and efficient. If you want more orders, just ask. I want advancement. I am Dravenger the apprentice. I am Dravenger the journeyman. I am Dravenger the swordsman. Your talents are noteworthy, but some question your depth of devotion. Perform more duty for the Fighters Guild, and you will earn your place. What else may I do? Elvain DeSalle owns owes one of our clients 200 septums. Deliver DeSalle's debt money to me. Elvian DeSalle runs a corner club in Saran. She owes Manus Oral or Threleth. One of our clients, 200 septums. Bring this money to me, and I'll let you keep half of it. Ooh, $100. Grand. All right. I'm I've listening. Got a few Please go ahead. It looks as though we will be... Wait. I went the wrong way. Do you need something? We're going to Saran, folks. Shall be a moderate walk, I believe. Ooh, the red sunrise.
Ah, just sing a song. It is said that when the red sun rises, the blood has been spilt on this day. Here's an old saying from another place, another time. Long forgotten. As we journey, I am reminded that if you are to engage in any further activities with this tale, please consider subscribing and hitting the bell notification in order to be alerted when tales of my exploits are available via automated courier. If you wish to be informed by other means, please consider following me on Twitch at Commander Calgon or on Facebook at Commander Calgon. Not wildly under, it's not wildly original, but, but, but you will get the idea. And uh, soon I will be streaming on both YouTube on this channel and Twitch in the near future. I just recalled that I don't have anything to enhance my personality once I get to Saran. I do hope they have something that I may use. If not, this is going to be a very difficult... Yes, a very difficult uh, task indeed. Here's something. <laughs> Wild beasts are no match for Draven Gur. Saran is a small port village. Well, not small. It's larger than Sedani. Oh, that is another ancient Dunma tomb. Perhaps we will visit it at some point, but not now. We are on mission. Michigan. We are on Michigan. I do believe that I see the towers. Ah, uh, the peoples of Saran. Argonians, mostly, unfortunately. Assigned into slavery, which I do not agree with. However, it is the way of this land. Whilst I may not agree with it, it is so. Perhaps someday there will be an uprising. There are always uprisings. Never ending battle.
Right. Let's run slave market, which I'm sure that we don't have any business going there Wealth right now. Beyond measure. Saran Trade House. Speak quickly, Outlander, or go away. Nothing. Illusion mysticism. You are just Where's useless. That slave? Not angry. Aha, main floor. What lovely canvas. <coughs> yes, I realize that I smell rather rather rank at the moment. But you don't have to make a big deal about it. They offer moon sugar? What a delightful change. They've decriminalized it. I will listen, Outlander, but make it quick. This is the temple. Apothecary. This could be where I receive what I need. Store personality. Tell Vonnie Bug. Fantastic, folks. Wait, didn't complete the transaction. Hey, you are done Be open to persuasion. Yes. We'll just spread the wealth around a little bit. See where that takes us. Go ahead. Of course, the fog moves in while I'm trying to examine the area. Oh dear. Trader. What have you? Interesting. Oh. It's cool looking, but it's not. Ooh. Now oh, that's interesting. Spoiled, really. An interesting, an interesting thing. Smith on broker, the outfitter. Sally's house of earthly delights. Well, this must be the place. Elvian de Sally. I gave her a hundred. Ooh. 
she doesn't want to pay. I will pay you only 100 more. <sighs> All right. I will try the Telvani bug must. You get one more chance. Sweet moon sugar. Mmm, she loves you. All right, you convinced me. Here's 200 gold. Excellent. I didn't want to kill anybody right now. Oh. Oh, that's unfortunate. Interesting. Is there no mages guild? I see no mages guild. Although I suppose I could take the silt strider back. I'm not crazy about that idea. But I will do so. I will do so this time. Day. I need to go to Balmora. Where would you have to go? I'm already on the good side of town. Now here's one who can hold their own. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. Here's the debt money. It is not enough. Ugh. Your talents are noteworthy. I'm still not I'm still not good enough for you. I have a bounty contract for the org Dura Grabol. This orc is an outlaw living openly in a house here on Balmora. I have a contract here that says 250 septums are yours if you bring her to justice. Fair enough. I'm listening, please. Go ahead. Do we know where her home is? Aha. Uh -huh. Don't press your Grub. Why should I speak with you, Don Mer? You shouldn't. Somebody wanted that woman dead. I delivered it. It gives me no peace. I'm listening, please go ahead. But I must do what well, is required. Here's a fine one. Speak freely. I have killed Dura Grabol. Thank you for the two hundred and fifty dollars. That is a really low price for a killing. I don't have any have orders. Uh, can you advance me? Oh, okay. I don't have any orders for anyone under the prank of Protector. Find out what you need for advancement. The guild stewards at Vivac City, Sedrith Mora, or Alderun may have more work for you in the meantime. I'm listening. Please go ahead. Excellent. So we have, we have done well. We have done well in this place. Do you need something? 
fighters guild missions very much very much complete in this area for now Rainus may have more Rainus may have more but for now it has been it has been a good several days and we have accomplished much hello Caius ah greetings Hey, what shall we talk about? Anything you wish, sir. We have multitudes of time. I am camping here tonight. Oh, we have ascended. Of course. Uh, more strength? Or, I mean, we've got a lot of strength. We're definitely doing personality. Let's do endurance. And let's do... Let's do those three. We'll, can't, we'll, we'll, not do the, we'll not do the strength this time. This will put us in a good place for the next time. Anyways, it's been a pleasure, heroes. We shall continue our adventure on the morrow. And again, I must stress, if you liked this video, please leave a like, leave a comment, tell me what you think, and consider to subscribe to my tale, for more adventures will surely be coming. Thank you once again. Adieu!